Feeling like your hormones are out of whack, but that blood test that your doctor ordered came back completely normal? Well, there's a little bit more digging we can do, so let's dive in. I have to say that hormone testing is not usually the first thing that I go to, but it is part of the complete package when, especially for me, when looking at symptoms at fatigue, anxiety, weight gain, difficulty sleeping, and all the things that can kind of come along with chronic stress and even burnout. Now that blood test that your doctor may order in office can be useful, but a lot of times it doesn't quite tell the whole story, which is why I love something like a urine test to give me a little bit more information. The one that I tend to use the most is the Dutch Plus by Precision Analytical. This test is a test that you can actually do at home and it uses not only urine, but also saliva. And what that allows it to do is use the metabolites or measure the metabolites of different types of sex hormones. But not only sex hormones, you also get a peek into cortisol, which is really important when we're dealing with stress. So this is great for both men and women. It not only looks at estrogen and progesterone, but also looks at things like testosterone, DHEA, as well as cortisol and cortisone. And it helps identify with which pathways your body are pushing or which pathways your body is favoring. And that can give us a lot of information about which herbs and supplements or which dietary or lifestyle modifications are gonna be most helpful and most effective. I find that this saves clients so much time and also so much money because you're not just throwing things at the problem. You actually have some information to go on and actually something valuable to use diagnostically. And one of the things that I really find important in my practice is the cortisol awakening response or the ability to look at your cortisol pattern throughout the day. This comes in real handy with symptoms like brain fog and fatigue and also with difficulty sleeping or difficulty waking up in the morning. And again, it allows us to pinpoint, okay, if there is an issue with cortisol, where exactly is it happening and what do we need to do about it? There are many other reasons why you could use something like a Dutch Plus test or a dried urine test looking at hormones. You could be tracking or trying to troubleshoot your menstrual cycle. It could be useful in monitoring any sort of hormone replacement therapy. Or again, you can use it in the way that I do, which is really trying to get to the root cause of symptoms like fatigue, weight gain, brain fog, insomnia, and all the things that kind of come along with being chronically stressed. If this sounds familiar or something that you would like to work on, you can learn how to work with me. You can click on the link in the description box below and you can learn more there about how I use these tests and how you can work with me in troubleshooting your symptoms. All right, I hope that this video was helpful. If you have any experience with this test, go ahead and leave me a comment below. Otherwise, I will see you in the next video. Bye.